<laughs> Are you guys both teaming up on me no, right now? Like, Jesse, how the f do you mess that up? So my girlfriend? What's a secret you have never told anybody? I know her deepest, darkest secret now, so. Stop it. Good job. Like, now we're gonna get in trouble. What's going on everybody? Jesse James West here. Hope you are ready for an amazing day. We are in the lovely city of Baltimore, Maryland, okay? We're gonna be doing so many different things. We have so Jesse! much play. Jesse! Yo! Yo! Go! 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 No! All right, now we're just playing, guys. We got a surprise for you. We got Noel here, baby! <laughs> she hitchhiked the entire country. I actually did do that. It was all worth it, though. I don't know how you hitchhike. You don't even have a backpack. All she got is a no, camera. I just got a camera. That's it. So we're going to be hanging out today. We have quite the endeavor this weekend. But for now, we're going to go get some food. We got training today. We got so much ahead of us. So let's get to okay, it. Okay, so here in Baltimore City, it is important that there is daylight. You should not walk anywhere if there is not daylight. It is like the top three most dangerous cities in America. I got you a hotel right down the road. So you'll be fine. Yeah, I'll be fine. Just don't walk around at night. Don't leave the... Hotel room. It smells strange out here. You might have pooped yourself. I did. Wait, where are we going into? We're going into the local drug dealer. I asked Bradley Martin where to go for the hookup, and he told me that it's right here. So something that's really funny that you could always do if you're gonna plan to pay for someone's breakfast or everyone's breakfast. Uh, I learned this from Brandon and Claudia. They said this in a video where let everyone buy their food thinking it's for themselves, that they're gonna pay for themselves, split the bill. And then at the end you go, oh no, 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 I got it, I got it. So that way everyone's really cheap on themselves and you don't present it right away. Cause if you present it right away like I am right now, I'd be like, I got it guys. They might just indulge too much and get like the entire menu. You actually are right. It's the opposite for me. Like when I know someone else is paying, usually I'll try to go cheaper. Especially if I don't know them that well. Because you're a good person. Noelle's gonna be saving me lots of money on this trip. Yeah, oh, look at those freaking pancakes. Look at these bad boys. Oh, look at this. Are you gonna eat some or no? I'll give you a little taste test. Are you gonna dabble or? I'll dabble in it like yeah. one bite. But I'm gonna stick to my home fries omelet that took 45 minutes to get here. You're chopping them in two. Do I really? Yeah. Where? In the middle? Like right see, here. See. <laughs> Is it bad? I'm like, it took 45 minutes, but I just looked like a fool with a freaking. <laughs> I need. Ketchup, stat. I'm kidding. I would never stab him. Don't do not snap at a, a waitress. And you guys know the words. It is last by always, forever, and more. Best by it. All right, that is a wrap on the meal. We're gonna head over to the gym now. We got some good shit to go over later. We got some food. I think we should just go. Let's go. There was a couple fighting next to us and I'm a little bit uncomfortable and really glad I'm in a healthy yeah. relationship. Now that you're seeing the big city, baby, in the blue sky, it looks amazing. It actually does. Do you like Baltimore? How do you like it so far? Okay, I like it, but yeah, obviously I would live here, but like to be here for a couple days is cool. Even though I was bashing saying it's a little bit of a dangerous place to be, Baltimore is pretty nice. When you go inland, if you see water, you're safe. If you see daylight, you're safer. At least I think so. I've been going on night walks. I've been really worried. We are inside the gym right now. We're about to hit a workout. We're gonna be hitting back. We have not worked out in quite a while. We typically do legs together, yeah. but I figured you guys don't want to be staring at my ass as much as you want to be staring at her back. We got a good workout ahead. Got a brand new program dropping on Black Friday. It's a virtual program that you guys can follow along while you're at the gym. It's amazing, my best thing yet. So keep an eye out, it's linked down below. But let's run it right now, like old times. Woo! Let's go. So first exercise we're gonna be doing, I'm gonna take you guys through this entire workout right now. We're gonna be doing a pull up as a female, not me. I just said that as if I'm a female, I'm a male. We're gonna be attempting to teach her a proper pull up. Have you ever done a pull up in your entire life? Sometimes I do try it after a back workout and then it's Yeah, but workout. if you're doing it after a back yeah, workout, no, no, no. your lats are gonna be exhausted. Exactly. So, so that's you just gotta why take I a leap know. of faith. I don't know how you're gonna do that with nails, not gonna lie. I feel like you got it, come on. Don't break your face. If you fall and break your face, I'm going to clickbait it. I know you are. Cross your legs and bring your heels back. Ready? Up. Pull. Pull. One. There you go. Two. One more. Six. Seven. Oh. I feel like I'm doing all the damn work. I was, that was more of a bicep curl. I can't do it. I actually can't. All 
All right, so next up, we're gonna be doing a straight arm cable pullover. This is by far the greatest back exercise. If I skip this, I don't get a good pump and I'm not sore the next day. Not that that's the only things that matter, but they definitely help with getting gains. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're doing a little construction here at uh, yeah. my new gym, okay? I just bought it, it's it's kind of part of the, the equation, you know, you move to Baltimore, you buy a gym. So we're gonna be doing some dumbbell rows. If you hear some screeching or anything, it's not like anybody's getting killed in the back. Well, at least we can't tell them that, but we're gonna be doing some dumbbell rows next. We're going heavy, okay? We're going four sets, six to eight reps. My shirt's coming off soon, I can feel it. Like I've never seen a girl with such crazy genetics. I kinda hate the arms, but... You know, she's like, oh, I don't even need to train arms. You know what, good for you, I do. Come on, Noel. I'm rooting for you. I don't really do this exercise that much. I'm gonna be honest with you. So my Listen, form might be trash. I will teach you how to do a nice dumbbell row. Pull bring it to it your forehead. Oh no. And then flip upside down. Okay, yeah, for sure. When you guys are doing a dumbbell row, focus on bringing your shoulder blade back and down while you pull. Okay, we're moving on to the second to last exercise. We're gonna be doing a hammer strength row, and then we're gonna be moving on to a lat pull down. Basically, finishing off the horizontal pull and the vertical pull, so we have a nice even, even back. And I'm gonna ride this thing like there's no tomorrow. Okay. That is how you push your homies, okay? You say two more, and then and they then keep going. You Listen, actually are like... I'm lying. Ten more. I promise you. Do it to the homies, even in the bed. <clears throat> Five more. Yeah, there you go. Two more. I'm trying. What? You went from one to two? That's two more. Oh, it's so crazy how much more you have in the tank than you think. Like, yeah. if I was alone, I would have stopped like five before. And she's going, one more, one more. I know she's doing it as a joke for the video, but I actually could do it. Now that you are a certified fit girl, what is the most attractive muscle on a man? Or even your man? My man. Back and shoulders. Your lobes? Back and shoulders. Biceps but are like easy to build, like I still the harder like to build. So, yeah. Do you but like the, the vein? Yes. Now that Isaiah's getting lean again, you're just gonna be like, oh, come to mommy. Yes. Come to mommy. Oh, is there a daddy and mommy? Definitely not. I feel like he calls you daddy and you call him mommy. Yeah, more like that. That's definitely correct. Okay, Noel, last exercise. Lat okay. pull downs. We're finishing off back nice and strong. Let's run it, baby. I think it's time for tarps off for the boys. Wait, I've never seen anyone end a back workout with a lot cool down. Listen, I'm gonna be honest too. I do things a little unorthodox. Are you getting lean again too? Listen, I've been dieting for like 45 days. I stopped drinking alcohol. Yeah. Has helped tremendously. I feel amazing. I feel like I don't have to be hungover once a week. I don't have to deal with saving calories and being starving that day. It's not a healthy mindset. Obviously, there's a time and a place where you wanna have the extra fun. And I think saving it like once a month rather than every other week. Good for you. That is a wrap on the back workout, ladies and gentlemen. What is up? Can we just take a moment? Because I was like so skinny the first time. Dude, literally. I did a video. The with first Jeff. time we did a video, like you did not have muscle. I at like all. watched it like kind of recent, like probably a month or two ago, and I was you like, "You were so innocent." I was, yes. What are you most proud of this this year of yourself? Like probably like not being afraid to be myself. Like, Good for you. Like, That's an amazing thing. Media on camera. Yeah. Yeah. I'd say the thing that I accomplished was like becoming more vulnerable. AKA falling in love. It's a big deal in my life. Like yeah. for the longest time I thought I wouldn't be in a relationship and I almost put up a barrier like no. Yeah. I would tell her at Zoo Culture, be like, yo, like I'm talking to this girl, but like no, like not dating, He's not like, dating. I don't see myself dating someone for like, like what you said like till, five till, years. For like five years. Shit, yeah. It's always the most amazing when you least expect it. Quick question for you. So I think in life, there's a lot of different crazy things that we've all have done and not done. What's a secret you have never told anybody? Or like, like what, or what's some, something juicy that you want to tell the audience? Involving what? Anything. Have you ever spoke to a celebrity? I've had a date with one. You did? Can you classify who? No, I never, I put that on social media. Before. Really? Can you tell yeah. me my ear? No way! Yeah. Yo, no way! That is a deep secret. You've never told anybody. Was it really small? I've made out for 30 minutes. 
that's it. It's like, oh, it thanks, God, I wanted to yes. see you. Yeah, that was weird that he started calling me, like, he was doing me like a homie, like, right after that, which is oh. fine. Like, we were just homies, but it was, like, just so weird. I know her deepest, darkest secret now, so you're gonna have to pay me a lot of money to get that out of me. That's a wrap on the workout. We're gonna head over, get some food. We might meet up with Claudia. We got a whole day ahead of us, so continue. Bang it out, boys. When in doubt, bang it out. When in doubt, bang it out. And subscribe. Okay, so we're gonna go introduce Noelle and Claudia. Figure if they're gonna do a truth or drink, they should probably like say hello a little bit. Yeah. Become friends. Yeah. Oh, we gotta hit the floor. I left my keys. Guys, there's a lot of stuff going on behind the scenes. There's a lot of things that's gonna be changing. It's been stressful as hell, I'm not gonna lie. But you gotta get through those days, you know what? Caffeine yeah. makes you more stressed, but you make more money. Okay, are you are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Brace for it. Why do I, we have I to race? I don't know how to do that. I'm ready? This is your new friend. <laughs> Hello! Hi! Oh Hi. my god! <laughs> nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Hey, you look nice beautiful. To meet you. Nice to meet you. <laughs> look how gorgeous she looks. Right. Got the hardest part up, over with. So, Claudia bought a brand new rug and she already wants to take it back because it smells well, funny. I'm thinking of keeping it, but I can't tell if I'm getting used to it, the, how it smells. Like when you walked in, did you smell something? I smell something different but it wasn't the rug it's not the rug, it's not the rug no i it smelled like it's getting better in here it kind of smells like your farts jesse no it doesn't <laughs> oh okay we got a rooftop and a guy named john out there i'm not gonna bother the man but i'm gonna make friends with him that's for sure Those, like i'm glistening on the inside and out also guys kennedy showed up so okay so we got some food we got supreme chips queso mm. guacamole hot sauce and then I got a giant bowl of double meat. So, yeah, Joey didn't want one either. Guys, we had What's big your, breakfast. Um, well, we went to this place. There's a, there's a couple that starts arguing next to us before we <laughs> No, leave. it was just like this weird place. As there. soon as we walked in, they were like really rude. They're like, where's your mask? And I was like, the table's right there. Can we just walk right Wait, there? And they're like, talking no. about when you ordered coffee and you're like, do you guys have almond milk? And they're like, no. Do you have any like other non-dairy milk? No. Do you have stevia? No. It's 2021, how do you not have any of that? <laughs> We're chilling on the rooftop, we have a 60 degree day. I'm literally the only person eating, but yeah, typical mukbangs or mukbangs, whatever you wanna call it, everyone eats. In this case, yeah. only I got food. in the photos. Stop it. <laughs> just give a kiss like this? Like this? Yeah, is it weird? I don't know. How does it yeah, look? Yeah, I don't like that. Is this weird? <laughs> Wait, let me see how you're sitting. That's I'm definitely just taking a seat. She's like drunk in the corner. You're trying to like... <laughs> <laughs> she's drunk. I'm like, babe, you need to go home. What about there? What there? No, Jesse, stop it. Good job. Like, now we're going to get in trouble for being up here because you decided to be an idiot. Put it back. <laughs> you can't put this back. <laughs> <laughs> Still my girlfriend? <sighs> Guys, sometimes you f up. I feel like I just went to the principal's office. I'm gonna be a kind person. I'm gonna make sure I pay for this. Let's get out of here. I'm uncomfortable. This is enough. Kennedy, your turn. See what happens. It might not break for one of you guys. That would be the dumbest decision ever. <laughs> Are you calling my decision dumb? Yep. I'm gonna have a long talk with you on why we don't name call in this relationship. <laughs> <laughs> it's literally what I got. No, Idiot. honestly, honestly, this is a scenario that you can call me an idiot. And you ruined my cookies? <laughs> <laughs> no! Jesse, how the f do you mess that up? Are you guys both teaming up on me no, right like, now? How do you mess that up? <laughs> I don't know. You're very passionate about calling me an idiot for this. <laughs> Listen, Jesse's cut off. We're gonna go get some food with the with the gang, okay? I really hope I still have a girlfriend after today. That was really embarrassing. I'm never I'm never doing anything stupid again. I learned my lesson. All right, folks. So it is now a little bit later in the day. We're gonna be going to get some food. Claudia is meeting us. And it's currently raining, so we're gonna have to quickly run through this monsoon. It's uh, not really a monsoon. To you, it's probably a monsoon because of LA it never rains. Okay, maybe. To me, it's a Sunday morning. You know what I'm saying? Hmm. Just a little wet. Okay. You never know how you wake up. It's not even Thanksgiving yet, okay? I don't, I don't mind the Christmas festivities, I love it. It's the most wonderful time of the year. Even though it's raining and not Christmas yet. Hello. Here's the thing, here's the thing. I need you to look at the menu before we do anything. I was just telling Noel, I was like, I have a strong feeling that Claudia is gonna be like, I don't wanna get anything. Not that you're picky or anything. It's supposed to look like we're on a ship and they're playing rap music. What It'll be does good. music and 
how it looks have to do with anything. Because the, the vibe is completely off. Ooh, popcorn. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Babe, what, uh, what brand is that? That's from Young LA? Yeah, they sponsor me. Is that, is that Code Jesse or Code Single Mom? If you guys use Code Jesse or Code Single Mom, you'll save 15%. You'll support me drastically. And you're going to get a girl I'm like Claudia if you wear this. <laughs> I promise you. Okay, so I'm going to be getting shrimp with no head, even though we prefer head with uh, <laughs> snow crab legs. I said to Noelle, I was like, they probably have a kid's menu, like if you don't like seafood. Tenders. And I was like, I was like, I don't really want chicken tenders, but so I was like, I came in here and I was like, okay, I'll get the salad then. And they're like, sorry, we don't have salad. And I was like, okay. So chicken tenders it is. I was like, okay, then I'll get chicken, chicken tenders. tenders pretty good. No. Wow. Is, is it a bib? Like, uh, it's, but it's more than a bib, I think it's like You put your arms through? You can wear it. No. That is the most adorable thing I've ever seen. You see, some of you are embarrassed to do the weird things in public. It's too bad I am the weird thing in public. This is so fitting for you. I'm loud and proud. Is that choking you? Yeah, but I like it that way. I think I look pretty good. That's a lot of chicken tenders. That is not off the kid's menu. <laughs> oh, no, it's definitely not. They said no butter. That's no like butter, no, yep, butter. no butter. Wow, this is amazing. I've never eaten out of a bag like this. Sleeves up, boys, sleeves up. Oh my lord. So we got a wonderful crab leg right there. We got some not meatballs, those are uh, potatoes. We got some shrimp. So we're gonna dive into this. I'm about to get extremely messy, so I really cannot hold the camera, I'm not gonna lie. I got a shrimpy. That's really good. It's very Cajun. We're in uncharted territory. Okay, I got it open. Okay, moment of truth, here we go. These ones are easy, like they come out in peach. Yo, this is so good. It's honestly like it's accomplishing to do this. I think it's time we indulge. Cheers to good food and free food. Big shout out to Rock and Toss out here in Maryland. Well, they just gave us some free food, okay? You see this? This is why I will not have a six pack tomorrow. Give it a I little bite, give it a little bite. I do love the Sprite Cowboy. Oh yeah. Mm. So we are gonna enjoy ourselves. That is me a full wrap on the video. If you guys enjoyed the little Noel Comes to Baltimore series, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, turn on your post notifications, follow the girl down below. Follow Claudia down below. Next time we'll visit her in California. Yeah, come on. Okay. Sounds good. Until next time, make sure you guys do not forget. Stay relentless.